Hey guys, welcome back to Oil Warfare Tycoon, or should I say War Tycoon, because today we're looking at another update, and it just so happens that they changed the loading screen name for this game. It says War Tycoon, and I ain't gonna lie, that's a pretty garbage name. Like, I'm not gonna go over the all the reasons why that's just such a horrible name, but this update isn't all bad, because they added the AC-130, which if you're not aware, it is just a cargo plane with guns attached to it. It's honestly pretty cool. And in order to unlock it, you need the operation, the vehicle operation, and you need to get 50 kills with the vehicle turret. That's very, very grindy. But once you unlock it, you can come in here and unlock it, and it'll be right here. And it is not exactly cheap. It's $100,000. But without wasting any of your time, let's actually test it out. Okay, so now that I'm in the AC-130, here's some of the things you might notice. So you can zoom in and zoom out you have a machine gun which you know pretty boring just a regular machine gun but then there's also a cannon and yeah this thing can absolutely decimate pretty much any ground target whatsoever honestly the main problem i see with this game is the render distance because like look you can't even what's the point of all the zoom if you can't even shoot people that's that are far away like look it just despawns it's just we got them Honestly, it is pretty crazy for taking down stuff like we're just we're absolutely taking down this vehicle right here One of the biggest pluses of this is how fast it can take down shields Like that is a full health shield and like that that was probably about 10 15 seconds Yes, we finally got that guy like honestly you do not stand a chance like this guy was going full out at me and he still didn't even stand a chance like look at my health down there also when you're running low on fuel you can just jump out over your target by pressing x so we're just gonna wait until i can go over a base that i want to drop onto yeah i mean we didn't do too bad we got three kills is it the fastest way to get kills no is it the best way to get kills also no but is it the funnest way to get kills Probably, but anyways, that's not all that came in this update. There's some there's a quite a few smaller things that I'm gonna go over right now Okay, so here are some of the things that they changed. They gave the PPSH a remodel I wouldn't really say it looks better I guess that they gave it some like 144p textures on that thing and gave it new sights But like it's still not my favorite gun the recoil is very low and I'd say that they made it better They also gave the m110 a new remodel the only other thing that's really worth mentioning is that they lowered the Chris Vector's recoil. Yeah, I still wouldn't call that exactly useful to be honest. But anyways, that's it for today's video, so make sure to like, subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video. Goodbye!